On Remembrance Sunday, Cardiff City women were away to Cumbran Celtic ladies in the Women's Welsh Premier League and a win would pull the Bluebirds level on points with the home side. And both teams lined up at the centre circle for two minutes silence. Into the action, Danielle Broadhurst headed back into the box for Amy Woffan to bring down and play in Lisa Bird, who put it wide under pressure from the defender. Cumbran had the opportunity to break the deadlock when a deflection off Broadhurst from Siobhan Walsh's clearance fell into the path of the home side striker to fire just wide. But it was the home side who broke the deadlock from this set piece. Cardiff failed to clear and a shot from the edge of the box from the top corner courtesy of a slight deflection. It took City just three minutes to equalise. A ball over the top was cut out by Shannon Evans. Kanisha Underdown then played the ball to Hattie Powell out wide. Powell went around the fullback with ease before curling a shot and finding the far corner. Surely a contender for November's goal of the month. Next came a great team move for Cardiff on 42 minutes. Kirsty O'Donnell plays the ball square to under down. One touch from Powell to play Amy Woffan on side, whose first touch on the volley was poked past the keeper to make it 2-1 going into half time. Great build-up work from City to give them a much-deserved lead on the break. In the second half, Cardiff were again looking dangerous. Brought her ball found O'Donnell. Her cross found Bird, whose effort was blocked by the keeper. 15 minutes in, Broadhurst and Underdown combined to find Wafan, whose daring effort from 25 yards was tipped over by the keeper. A good save from the Celtic stopper to deny Wafan from long range. Only two minutes later, City were on the attack again. And a down to O'Donnell with a great ball whose intended cross was delivered with a bit of luck to beat the keeper at the far post. Another impressive goal for Cardiff, extending their lead to make it 3-1. So at this point, Cardiff looked dominant. Good control here from Lisa Bird to cut inside two defenders and finish with a strike that looked to be in, but hit the side netting. Cardiff corner. Evans getting close, hitting the woodwork, literally. Luckily though, the left back wasn't put out and was okay to continue. Then it was Combrand's turn to hit the woodwork from this free kick. But Cardiff managed to clear. And so a great win for Cardiff City women who are now joint fourth in the league and they're next in action on the 16th against Merthyr Town ladies in the Welsh Cup.